Hey guys, I'm Kimberly from Fat Quarter Shop, and as we start 2022, I wanted to introduce you to a new hobby. So if you are on a budget and you're looking for a hobby that's not very expensive, cross stitch is going to be great for you because you don't need that many supplies and it's super easy. You can do it on the go. You can do it at a football game, basketball game, in the car. I cross stitch everywhere. So to cross stitch, you really only need five things. At Fat Quarter Shop, we have tons of free patterns. So get your pattern, then you can pick your floss. Floss is super inexpensive. And then cloth can be super inexpensive all the way to very expensive. So very easy to find an inexpensive cloth. And then you need a needle and scissors, super easy. And I think we can start cross stitching under $30. Now, if you already have scissors at home that you think will work, you have even more room because you'd only need to buy four things. So let's visit fatquartershop.com. Let's look at what they have for cross stitch and let's start a new hobby for under $30. So I'm gonna start shopping at my favorite store, of course, Fat Quarter Shop. I'm gonna start with the pattern first. And so I'm just gonna go to the cross stitch category. And to save money, I'm gonna first look at our free cross stitch patterns just to see what's free and you know what I think is cute. This is really cute. The stitches from the heart. So this is cute. This Home Stitch Home is really cute by Tiny Modernist. I'm gonna look and it has five colors. So I think I'll do this one maybe. So I can just download the PDF later, but I'm gonna write down the colors that they have listed and then I'm gonna change the colors. Five colors is pretty good. So they have Ecru, 38, 55, 38, 54, 33, 47, and 38, 48. So now I'm gonna shop those colors and I am gonna use DMC floss because it is very economical, but I'm gonna change the colors. So it's got like two oranges that go here, this little gray, aqua, and some orange. So I'm obviously gonna change some of this and I'll do my cloth probably last. So I'm gonna first just start with the colors they have and then convert them. And doing a free pattern and very inexpensive floss is a great way to start because we're gonna try to shop under $30. So they're, I'm gonna add all these to my cart. I'm gonna take them out, but that's their light autumn because I'm gonna replace them in a minute, but I wanna be able to remember what they look like. So two different oranges. So those are for the flowers. So I could even go pink there. Ooh, green. Okay, awesome. And then that's like the teal green, which of course I'm gonna change and then I'll add the ecru. And let's see if what five flosses are gonna cost. Let's see. So that's $5.34 for the floss. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna convert my floss. I'm gonna leave the ecru, but I think I want more of an aqua. So I'm gonna just search DMC aqua and see what I get. Okay, I'm gonna go to the floss page for DMC and then search that way. So floss, thread, and then the manufacturer I'm gonna select is DMC. And I'm gonna use DMC because it's the least expensive out of all of the brands. And I like these colors. So this is actually $7.98, $2.64 less. So I don't need all those colors, but I could write down the colors. Let's see. I could do the house two-toned. I think I'm just gonna buy this thread pack and then I can take these out. That'll make it easy so that I have several colors to choose from. Like I could even make the house two-toned because it has two aquas. So then we're at $7.98. So then that gives me $22 left. So I've got my pattern and my floss. Now let me figure out my cloth. I'm gonna definitely use Ada, so I'm gonna first go to cross stitch cloth, and then I'm gonna select Ada because I like Ada the best. I'm gonna select 14 count because that's my favorite. And then I'm gonna sort by least expensive to most expensive so that I can shop price. Okay, so these are your less expensive. These Charles Craft are a little bit uh, stiff, so I might not wanna do those, but these, this is a really good price right here. These Cosmos. So let's see if we can find a white Cosmo. There we go, $7.24. So let's see, we're at $15.22, so we have 15 more dollars to spend. We need scissors and a needle. So let's see, I'm gonna go to needles. I'm gonna search by size 26 because size 26 is what I'm gonna need and I'm gonna go by price also, since we're on a budget. So size 26, ooh, $1.24, there we go. That's what I'm gonna get. And then I need some scissors. I'm just gonna type scissors. Lots of scissors. The main thing is you want them to be pretty sharp. 
these are probably nicer. $4.48. Okay, so let's add that. Ooh, I have $8.06. Oh gosh, what can I buy for $8.06? Maybe a needle minder? Well, since I'm stitching a house, I would need something that's similar to a house. But you know this little bird might match. It's aqua. Okay, let me add that. Ooh, let's see what else. Ooh, $28. Okay, is there anything that's $1.50? So it looks like I have $1.50 left, but I'm going to look at my choices. I'm happy with my fabric and my floss for sure. The only thing I'm concerned about is the needles are a little bit on the less expensive side, and I might want a little bit nicer needles. So I'm gonna just search and maybe replace the needles with nicer needles. So I'm gonna type size 26 needle. Ooh, Bowen, Bowen, those are good. Bowen size 26, and I use size 26 with my 14 count. So, ooh, right there, ooh, yay. Okay, now let me take the other cheaper ones out. Oh my gosh, I think I accident, what if I get to exactly 30? $30.13? Oh no! So now I gotta take the scissors out. And I have to find scissors that are $4.35. Maybe I'll have to get the scissors instead and then take the needle minder out. But these are really cute. Let's see. Let me take the needle minder out. Let me just do the scissors. Let's see. These are my favorite scissors right here. Let's see what that is. They're really expensive though. They're $18. So I know they're gonna be over my budget. Oh my gosh, over my budget. Okay, let me go back to the sweet snips. Okay, let's see, cross our fingers. Take this one out. Okay, I have $4 and six cents I can spend now. Spring tension hoop. 348, okay, let me look at this other one. Ooh, right there, okay, ooh, I think I made it, I think I made it, ooh, I only have eight cents left, so check it out, let's look at my card. So we can now make a project. Oh my gosh, we've got the Bloomtopia thread pack. We have just a white 14 count Cosmo and it's 14 by 17. So I need to look at that pattern again to make sure it fits. So I'm gonna do that also. I've got a really nice pair of scissors and really nice needles and I have a hoop. So let's go back to the Tiny Modernist free pattern. So I'll go back to the cross stitch free patterns. This says 14 count, it will finish at four by five and a half. So a 14 by 17 is plenty big. I could probably stitch that twice. So I'm ready to go. We have spent $29.92 and we got five items and they're all really um, nice quality. So I'm gonna go ahead and check out at Fat Quarter Shop and then we'll be right back and see what I bought and how it looks. Now I've got all my stuff for under $30 at Fat Quarter Shop. You're gonna wanna visit our floss tube and watch our Cross Stitch University so you know how to cross stitch and subscribe to this channel. Can't wait to see what you make for under $30. See you next time.